After installing the virtual machine and using SQL Developer or some of the other tools to try and connect to the database, you may find that you're not able to connect. Now, part of the reason for this is that your network connection needs maybe a slight update. Now, this won't happen in all scenarios. So if you go into your network settings, by default, you're going to have um, a connection there that's going to be set up as having ticked uh, cable connected. And if we go in, we'll be able to see all the different um, ports that have been mapped. Okay. So what you need to do is create another adapter. All right. So create a NAT. Just make it exactly like the first one, but this time set the cable connected to being on ticked. So that will allow you to be able to work with uh, on Wi-Fi. Okay, so by having both network connectors there allows you whether you're using wired like a network cable or if you're on Wi-Fi. And by doing that um, and restarting your VM, you'll be able to connect to uh, the schemas in the database.